students and welcome to my tutorial. Our today's tutorial is to do a science experiment and it is about cold water and hot water. We are going to see how the molecules of coloring agents get diffused into the water with time. It also explains to us about the kinetic theory of matter. So let us come forward and see how to perform this practical. The materials required in preparing this practical are you need a syringe, blue color food coloring, red food coloring. I couldn't get the liquid so I have this powder. I'm going to turn it into a solution. Turn it into a solution. I have a bowl and a spoon. Two clear glasses. One contains the cold water and one contains the hot water. Hot water is not a boiling water. It's a normal water. And this is a cold fridge water since it is giving some vapors outside and this is uh, like water precipitation like stuff here. So what you can do is you can just rub it with the tissue so that you can easily see it the, from the clear glass. If you can get more big glasses it's good. So to prepare the powder solution for the red I am just taking little bit of this powder of the color. Putting into the bowl. I had already pre-sucked some water from the glasses just to level at them and I put it into the syringe that water I'll put in this after putting that water the solution will automatically be prepared because the powder the food coloring powder will get dissolved into it if I feel there is any lumps then I will just simply take my spoon and then mix it there can be some crystals as such no problem about that you just have to take the coloring area out. Alright, this is ready. So what I can do is, you have some extra tissues also you will need just to clean up the excess mess. Now, since your color solution is ready, the red color will be for hot water and the blue color is going to be for your cold water. Let us come forward and just start it. Again, little bit rubbing from here. Okay. What I'll do is I'll take this red color and the blue color. First, let me take little bit of red solution into the syringe. And then drop it into the water. Please pay attention on this side of the glass. For two minutes, you need to observe it, how the color looks like. So I'm just putting two drops. You have to observe the movement of the liquid. These four drops I have put into it. Now the next one is. If I want I can clean up the syringe. Now I have to take the blue liquid. Again two drops. Look at its speed. How slow. Same four drops I am putting. How slowly it is getting diffused in here, whereas this one has completely got dissolved. This is what it shows that in hot water, the molecules start to move faster at a very constant speed. And this is why the diffusion takes place early as compared to cold water. Here the molecules are cold, they have very less speed, less pressure that makes the molecules to move very slow. That is why till now this has not yet dissolved whereas this one has completely dissolved. This is what the whole tutorial is about kinetic molecular theory that the temperature, pressure, atmosphere three important things are very important while performing kinetic theory. Here were the examples that you had seen. So thanks for watching the video.